coaches gave us a great game plan, get the ball out of PG's hand, and we'll with the results. You know, in the timeout, just came back and said we're going to hit him, you know, and um, had JR on him, and LeBron was the hit guy, and um, just come up aggressive, make him get rid of it. So the team did a good job of following the game plan, got it out of his hands, and make someone else beat us. You know, luckily, we knew the clock was going down, and, um, you know, CJ pretty much had to go you know, ISO or try to put up a shot against RJ. And RJ did a great job of trying to cut him off and making him reload his shot and still getting a contest. So, um, you know, it's, when you guard in our league, the guy who gives up the ball is sometimes the most dangerous because you tend to relax and he can come back and get it. So, you know, we just have to have our antennas up. It was, just, it was really big for our team, uh, just the momentum um, and just understanding, uh, you know, how big of a stop it, it it was for that moment. No, that's something we've worked on for the last three years. And especially like the last year and a half when T. Lou took over, it's something we've always had in our package versus any dynamic score or any guy that has a role in. So, you know, um, it's not something we made up or something that we haven't done before. Um, we just had in our back pocket and we used it tonight. He missed, we won. You know, so.